My father, Raphael, is a quirky, full of life, wonderful, somewhat eccentric, intelligent and passionate father and husband and friend. When I first diagnosed with prostate cancer, I knew that I'm now facing a battle. It's like uh, I was born in Israel, I served in the military over there for a long time in the security forces, and I knew that I have a major, major enemy here. I first met Rafi about 13 years ago when he had developed recurrent prostate cancer. It was a different era where we didn't have that many treatments at our disposal. His prognosis at the time was supposed to be around two years. At the time his cancer started to get worse was when I, was, I got more involved in research and joined the PCF family and received my PCF Young Investigator Award. We had a PCF-funded trial available to us, which he received, and luckily he responded. Your playlists are 41 today, so they're, you're, they're up and your body's recovering. It's fantastic. That means a lot, so tonight I can go to a movie with my wife, my daughter, and my son-in-law. We were close to running out of options, so I do believe that that clinical trial saved his life. But it didn't last forever and eventually as prostate cancer grew again, we still didn't have much else out there. He was able to benefit from going on additional clinical trials and also got therapies that became available through research, through the PCF, and that includes the drug that he's on today that he started essentially the week after drug approval and continues on. Today my PSA is below 0.06. They call it undetectable. It's the greatest thing. I, I feel like uh, <laughs> I'm in a new world. In the last 10 years, I saw my daughter get married. Then two years later, my son got married. In the last decade, uh, Rafi has become a grandfather three times over. I owe Dr. Tagawa my life. It, it's so simple. He's always investigating, always researching, and then he's investigating again. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Tagawa. Thank you, everyone who has been involved. I happen to be uh, like uh, 81 and 11 months as of today. I count every day because every day is a new year for me.